aquarium co-op or else you guys know that guy my fishing buddy sam hi sam um he helped me i'm walking backwards he helped me catch 30 of these guys we're gonna take them home i'm gonna show you what they are and um i'm gonna show you a, a, little, a little surprise a little surprise who do we have here sexy model what's up what's up Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is gonna be a little bit slow. Obviously behind me, you can see there's a ton of fish. Obviously this is not my tank. This is Corey's tank and this is where he houses his candy stripe plecos. Today we're gonna be adding 30, not one, not two, not three rings, but 30. Uh, we have pygmy rainbow fish, pygmy. Anyways, they're very beautiful. Robert doesn't understand why we got them. That's because uh, we, we kept them in quarantine for like a whole month. Haven't had time to bring them home and put them in the tank or decide on what tank to put them in. So I had to take them home today. We're gonna put them in this tank and uh, see how they do. I gotta clean this tank a little bit, take out that dead java fern. I just plopped them in. Um, hasn't, it hasn't even been like five minutes yet. We're gonna let them sit there for a while. And um, I wanna show you my Groot tank. The tank I was inspired to build by Caleb Overholes. And if you guys are still watching all these videos, all the money, and revenue from these videos, not just the one video I made about how to edit your fish, but all the videos across my platform, all the revenue will go towards his GoFundMe. So just a reminder. Now let's go check out that tank. I'm gonna give you a little taste. Ooh, child, things are gonna be easier. Ooh, child, things will get brighter. Bring it down hard. Sunday, put it together. What are you doing? Taste it. <laughs> Welcome to my bedroom, guys. This is the first shot I ever had of my bedroom. Well, you, get to, you guys don't get to see it, but you get to see the tank. Um, this tank is inspired by Caleb, like I said. It's a Groot tank. Now, um, this is the Denerly Shrimp King tank. Thank you to Corey from Aquarium Co-op for giving me this tank. It's a 10 gallon. It comes with the light, the cool glass curve right like that, and uh, it comes with a filter. So. Very excellent tank, very clean looking. Everything is well put together. The package is the best I've ever seen. It's like an Apple package, very nicely put together. So I highly doubt you're gonna get a messed up one if you order one. You could buy one of these at the store. We don't sell them online, it's at the store. I equipped mine with the Denerle CO2 um, bottle here that you can buy sold separately and it's awesome. I wasn't gonna show you guys this tank just because I wanted it to fill out but I guess like other YouTubers, I'm gonna take you on this journey with me. There's baby teeters that are starting to crawl right there. You see what I did there? Um, and Staragani Repens and a little bit of Christmas moss. There's a little pod back there that you see. Um, all of it is filled with fluval stratum. As soon as I find a little raccoon that's cool enough to fit in that side pod, uh, I'm gonna put him in there so it looks like he's in a little space pod. But yeah, I wasn't really gonna show you guys, but this is the tank here and um, I absolutely love it. No complaints with it. A light is doing just fine, just shedding on these uh, plants. When I took home these Stargani repens, it was melting really, really bad, even before I put it in this tank. And Ali said I could just take it home with me. Um, so once I put it in here and it's doing like two, it's about two bubbles a second. Really good CO2 in here. So it's growing really well. Um, all that spider wood you can find in a package at Aquarium Co-op. I believe it's like 30 bucks for a big, big package. And uh, the Groot you can find somewhere on eBay. It's probably about 10 or 20 bucks, depending on where you look. And uh, that's about it. Very simple video today. I didn't want to go overboard. I spent a lot of my time today just driving around town. I went to get my drone fixed so I can have it ready for Hawaii. Um, so that's cool. A uh, little Nerite snail there. Hope you guys enjoy this short video. I know it's not much, but I hope you guys watch it over and over again uh, just so I get the revenue for it so I can uh, donate all that to Caleb Overhauls. And if you haven't checked out the GoFundMe yet, I'm gonna link that one more time. This is for you, Caleb. Hope you like it. Actually, I know you like it because your mom told me so. Enjoy the tank. Not a lot of B-roll today, guys. Wait a minute. Who am I kidding? Let's roll it.
All right, guys, thanks for joining me today. I'm just gonna release these guys into the tank. I'll get B-roll of them tomorrow because I usually don't get B-roll the same day. It's just so it helps them color up and get used to the tank a little bit, but Thanks for watching this short little video and uh, enjoy the rest of your day. By the way, I believe in two weeks, I'm gonna be live streaming on the Sunday right before I leave to Hawaii. So make sure you tune into that one. Maybe I'll schedule it. I think I will. The sun will come out tomorrow. Be free. Plop and drop and stop somewhere. Over the ring. All right, guys. Wow, some of them are actually coloring up pretty good. But still, I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. And, uh. Oh. <gasps> yes. Ooh.